you know, when I write, I can only I write about myself, and 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 she, she is she, she it she gets a depression, and and this is more or less a description of you know, you know my my own depression. So uh, so, <clears throat> but 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 somehow I I I see myself in both of the sisters, and uh, and it's kind of you can also if you choose, see them as one person, two sides of the same person. I, uh, I, I think that's how I write. I, I, yeah. S to some degree, it is quite refreshing to to make a film about when you f about bad things, right? It's not it's not that you you go around feeling bad all the time while you do it. Uh, actually, the opposite. You kind of uh, gain something from uh, from from having had a bad time, and you kind of analyze it a little bit by working with it. And uh, no, it's I I I, th I would say that the mood was very, uh, the shooting was fine and very. Extremely nice people to be with and a good actor, so we had a good time shooting it. No, I'm, I'm. No, I don't have a. You don't because you make a, a tragedy. You don't go around kind of crying all the time. It's kind of professional, I would say. Claire is representing the sane, normal human being who has, compared to Justine, something to lose. Um, she has a family. She she's not nearly as egocentric as as Justine is, um, and she would. She, in in this uh, <clears throat> catastrophe situation, she would panic, typically. We have this uh, overture uh, where we kind of, <clears throat> where we play a little bit with the disaster cliches, you know, and picture-wise and, and, and stuff. And then when the real disaster comes, there's almost none of all that. Um, it's, it's, uh, it's based a little bit on the idea that there are this type of film where you know what's going to happen. You know, for instance, if they go on board Titanic, then you kind of, ah, is it going down? You know, you, you, you have an idea of what is going to happen and you know what's going to happen and still the film is worthwhile seeing because you, you, you're not in doubt of what is going to happen, but you want to, you follow the characters, the characters that you've learned to know and, and you follow them through, through, through this and, and first of all, you want to know how is it going to happen and how is it going to influence. And, and um, <clears throat> It's it's uh, there's quite a lot of, of films like that. I just saw in Cold Blood, a uh, 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 Truman Capote uh, f uh, film after the Truman Capote book, and you know that they're going to kill this family, and you know that they're going to be, and they they will hang afterwards. And still, it's a very very exciting film to 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 watch. So 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 the. The, the normal thing you or the thing you would say normally was that you you know you sh you should be really you you shouldn't say what is going to happen that's kind of the normal thing you would say but but i i will still claim that in most films you know what will happen you know james bond survives right and f for other films, you you know what will happen, and still you're kind of you you you're you're very interested because you want to know how is it going to be, and how will James Bond or whoever uh, react to it.
very early on in the project, I, I, I chose some music from, from Wagner, which is the uh, pre prelude to uh, Tristan and Isolde. <clears throat> and that is not what you would consider melancholic music. That is what you would call romantic music. And I would say that that has kind of somehow uh, turned the whole thing into a very romantic film also in the images and stuff. It is highly romantic. Also the whole idea about this uh, planet coming and uh, this woman's relationship to the planet and stuff. Everything has a, a, a romantic ring to it. Um, so I have probably tried to make a romantic film and and I'm just a little worried that I succeeded too well <laughs> when we're talking about that it should maybe have a bit more kind of I don't know some more roughness to it but that was not this film it's it's kind of it you know these images kind of make themselves in a way um, it's not completely logical that a film about the end of the world should be a romantic film, but it, I, I, it, it kind of had its own life, and 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 I would say that the film, or anyway, looks like a romantic film.